All right guys, so we definitely have an issue that we need to address and fix. I'm really hoping it's not the cylinder head gaskets. If it's that, then uh, that would really suck. When starting a project like this, there's always gonna be ups and downs. For me, I was so excited finally looking through the auction for my own truck, one of the newer Humvees. I haven't even seen one of these in person. So being able to purchase one of these and own one, it was just so exciting for me. And then came the actual auction. So my adrenaline was rushing. I was so excited. And then finally I got the winning bid and it was lower than what I was willing to pay for that thing. So right after that, I remember calling up all my friends, showing them all the cool pictures and I just could not stop talking about it. Then came the very long wait. I waited months for this thing to, to finally be released. And I was checking almost every single day the, the website, checking up on the, the release status. And then months went by. Then I finally got the call that it was ready to be picked up and a couple days later it arrived at my house. I was so excited. I was beyond happy with the thing. But you know, even though it kind of looked like a pile of junk, to me all I could think about was how it's going to look when I'm done. So it might not look like much now, but the whole process of restoring it and fixing all the problems, that's, that's what I love. That's what makes me happy. And being able to record it and share it with you guys, that's just such an awesome feeling for me. But one of my problems is sometimes I do get overwhelmed with the amount of work, but I just have to keep telling myself not to give up and just knock something small out every single day. So every small job done will add up until everything has been completed. So taking a large project like this and breaking it into smaller jobs makes something like this not feel too overwhelming. So I guess what the point I'm trying to tell you guys is do what makes you happy. Do, it, do what you love. You know, you might have some bad days along the way, but in the end, you won't regret spending your time doing something that you love. Hey guys, I thought it was important that I'd share this with you. In the next episode, we'll be showing you how I got this thing started, and then we'll also be diving into uh, what is wrong with it and uh, coming up with a game plan on how to fix it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.